Hey YouTube, sorry to burst your bubble with this video, but I just wanted to let you know that as of today, the 25th of April 2017, no jailbreak has come for iOS 10.3 or above. Also, it is highly unlikely that one will be coming anytime soon. So do not waste your time listening to scammers. I was not going to make this video, but the other day when I was searching for jailbreak iOS 10.3.1, I stumbled upon a whole list of videos with a lot of views. All of these are scams. I know that Apple has patched the Wi-Fi vulnerability that the Yalu jailbreak was relying on. So the Google Project Zero no longer works on 10.3 or over. Apple's official release notes on the Apple website shows that iOS 10.3.1 fixes the Wi-Fi exploit discovered by Google Project Zero. Let me prove this to you. Let's pick up the most popular video. It is by Sam1162. It's got over 400,000 views. On this video, he asks you to head over to iOS jail.com. As you can see, on the phone's browser, this would seem like a terminal instruction being triggered. But the truth is, it is just a website displaying this. I'm running this on a Mac, and it is showing directories named storage on it that do not exist on my laptop. Now, when you click on any of these ads, the owner of the website gets paid. It does nothing else. Try posting a comment on the video saying it is fake, and the comment will get removed in a few hours. All these scams are pretty similar. Remember, subscribers, comments, and likes can be bought. Follow someone reliable, like everything Apple Pro. Anyways, it is not all bad news though. There is a mobile security conference that is being organized by the Pangu team on the 23rd of June this year. You can be sure that all the big names of jailbreaking will be there. I am sure that there will be something interesting coming out of that conference. Based on the agenda, it is likely that there will be a watchOS jailbreak coming soon. As for the phone, remember that WWDC is planned between the 5th and the 9th of June 2017. iOS 11 will be revealed during the event, and it is highly unlikely that the jailbreak developers will be letting out any known exploits before iOS 11. If they do, Apple will easily patch it up with iOS 11. So again, don't hold your breath on seeing a jailbreak before iOS 11. If you're looking for news and updates, follow the reliable names on YouTube and Twitter. Do not pay anything to anyone. Remember that jailbreaks are always free. If you're lucky to be in a jailbreakable version of iOS, which is up till 10.1.1 on iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, and 10.2 on all the other devices. Stay there, do not upgrade. And remember to back up your SHSH file to secure the jailbreak. For those of you who have already upgraded, the closest you can get to a jailbreak for now is to install some apps that are not available on the App Store. Click on the annotation now to see how you can do this. All the websites I showed you for information are genuine websites. I will leave the links in the description. If you are a developer and are interested in working on jailbreaks, the following links are the best place to get started. I will leave them in the description as well. Google Project Zero with the details of the Wi-Fi exploit, the source code for the latest Yalu jailbreak, the Cydia source code, and finally, Cydia Impactor. Subscribe to be updated. Thanks for watching. Take care.